In this video lecture, we are going to learn about diodes. A diode is a semiconductor component which allow current to flow only in one direction. Current flows from anode to cathode only. It is one of the basic component in electronic circuit that is used for protection, rectification, switching and in many other applications. We have different types of diodes. First is a simple PN junction diode and it is mostly used as rectifier for converting AC into DC and it is also used in many other applications like in clipper and clapper circuit. Next we have Zener diode. As Zener diode works in a reverse bias mode only and once it reaches the breakdown voltage, even if you increase the input voltage, the output voltage doesn't change. So it means it maintains a constant voltage at its output after the breakdown. So because of this property, it can be used as a constant voltage source in many applications. Next we have a shorty diode. Shorty diode has a forward voltage drop of 0.15 to 0.45. So it is very less as compared to the forward voltage drop of a PN junction diode which is around 0.7 volt. So because of this, it has a very high switching speed and because of high switching speed, it is used in many applications where speed, high speed is required. Next we have a tunnel diode. Tunnel diode has a very fast response time. So because of this, it finds application in many areas. It is used in oscillators, microwave amplifier, in FM receivers, etc. Next we have light emitting diode. Light emitting diode is when forward bias, it converts the electrical energy into light. Because of this property, it finds application in displays and in many indicating devices. Next we have a photodiode. Photodiode is a reverse of light emitting diode that it converts the light energy into electrical energy. When light falls on the top of it, and enters through this transparent area into it, converts that light energy into electrical signal. It allows the reverse current when lights fall on it. So it finds application in different remotes and in many other applications. Next we have laser diode. Laser diode also converts electrical energy into light energy and it finds application in CD players. It is also used in optical fiber communication where light is used to transfer the data. It is also used in different medical instruments and for different medical treatments also. Next we have a vector diode. It acts as a variable capacitor when it is reverse bias. So it finds application in areas where variable capacitor is required. So we can use vector diode in those applications. Next we have a PIN diode. PIM diode has a P type uh, semiconductor layer, then I intrinsic layer and then N type layer. So that is why it is called PIN diode. When it is reverse biased, it acts as a capacitor and when it is forward biased, it acts as a variable resistor. So because of this property, it finds application in many areas. 